What's up, YouTube? So just want to give you guys a brief uh, inventory here. Uh, I was able to pick these four tins up today. These just dropped earlier in the week. The Articuno, Motrez, and uh, Zapdos tin. I'm going to be opening up these two as well. Uh, the good thing about these two tins is that they each have three Evolving Skies packs. They're super expensive, super hard to find. Booster boxes are almost non-existent. And if you find them, 400 bucks online. As I mentioned before in my previous video, we are running out of space, guys. But we are planning on opening this. So stick around and see what we can get. Okay, guys. So let's just set this up real quick. We have the Tyranitar. Uh, Tyranitar, excuse me. B promotion. And we also have the employee... Em and Polion B uh, promotion card as well. Let's start off with these two since I'm curious to see what we can pull from the Evolving Skies packs. We will open up the first tin here. If only I had something to open this with. Actually, I should have prepared a little bit better. Man, oh man. All right, let's do it like that. There we go. I believe there's three versions of these tins. This is actually the third one. When they first released it, there weren't any Evolving Skies packs in them. Um, so after the third reprint, I guess, or restock, it's a nice looking card, they saw how rare the Evolving Skies packs, how much they were going for online. So I believe these come with five booster packs. So we do have a Brilliant Stars. We have another Brilliant Stars. And there are the Evolving Skies, guys. So we got one, two, three Evolving Skies. Guys, these go for about 30, 35 bucks. Um, just if you want to do the resale and, and look online, the Evolving Skies packs are going for as much as $11. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that promo code right back in there. It's a nice card, but it's not what we're looking for. All right, we'll put that to the side. And what do you say we open up the Tyranitar? See if we can pull out some more Evolving Sky booster packs. All right. This one's a little bit easier to open. There is the Tyranitar. Guys, it's actually really hard to find... Um, the Brilliant Stars booster boxes. Um, the only way we're getting Brilliant Stars now, we gotta get creative. We have to get the Brilliant Stars Elite Trainer boxes. I got three of those. I plan on making a video on opening all three. So let me go ahead and put this Tyranitar right back in there. That is not what we're looking for. Put that right over here, guys. And we have another Two brilliant stars, which is what we're looking for, and more evolving skies, which is what we're looking for. That Umbreon is going for a lot of money, guys. So let's put the evolving skies together. All right. So we got six evolving skies. We have four brilliant stars. What do you say we start with the brilliant stars pack and see if we can get lucky? Just pick these up today. All right. Let's see what we have here. Okay, we have an energy, another energy, Grottle, here we go, Sneasel, Clink, Spirit Bomb, Axu, uh, Impilimp, a Reverse Hollow Heatran, and a Holographic Bebarel. All right, not bad. We got a Holographic and a Reverse Hollow. Let's put that over here. Let's move on to the next pack. One, two, three, four. Should be an energy. All right, energy. Executor. A trainer card. There we go. Gibble. Trap inch. Okay. Reverse hollow and a non-holographic rare. Electivire. Okay. 
Interestingly enough, both of these cards came without the black borders on them. One of them did have a reverse hollow and a holographic. The other one did not. So this is interesting. Usually with the black borders, we expect a holographic or a V or a V the Max or something like that. Um, so let's, I'll monitor that. There's the black borders there. So there is a guaranteed holographic aside from the hologra um, the reverse hollow that we usually get. So we have an energy here, play it all, trainer, another trainer. Okay, got a blast, Clefairy. All right, sock. Here is a reverse hollow trainer card and a Pikachu V, guys. That's nice. I don't have this artwork. That looks really sweet. All right. Full art. Pikachu V. Looks good. I will take it. Last pack, guys, for the Brilliant Stars. Let's see what we got. I'm excited to share this experience with you guys. As always, thank you so much for joining me. Let's see what we get. It's an energy trainer. Two trainers. Sneasel. Porfish. Magmar. I got a reverse hollow on that. There's a spirit bomb. Lucario. Holographic. I actually have that. And that was the rare card. All right. I have that Lucario. All right, guys. Dun, dun, dun. Evolving skies. Let's go. Man, that Umbreon looks sweet. That Umbreon looks so nice. Artwork just looks incredible. But let's see what we can get, guys. All right. One, two, three, four. Let's move on. Fire Energy. Trainers back to back. Hitmochan. Got a few of those. All right. Yersa, Mareep. Here is a Reverse Hollow Feeble. And a non-holographic rare, Talon Flame. All right, moving right along, guys. Moving right along. Stick around. I plan on opening the three Legendary Birds uh, tins as well. Those just dropped as early as last week. Um, so, planning on opening those in the same video. Let's see what we got, guys. Energy. Two trainers back to back. Psyduck. Swablu. Dot. Woobat. Reverse Hollow Digging Gloves and another non holographic Talon Flame. Interesting. Two back to back non holographic Talon Flames. All right. Let's open up the Umbreon. Let's see what we get here. All right. Let's put that right over there. Another green card. Not expecting much from this, uh, from this pack either, but. Let's see what we can get. Here's a Pikachu. That's a nice Pikachu. Reverse Hollow C dot and a non holographic Militic. I actually have a full art Militic um, that we collected from a previous deck. So, from a previous booster pack, I apologize. If my voice sounds a little scratchy, guys, I am uh, a little sick. I think I'm coming down with a cold. I'm not sure what it is. But, uh,. Thanks for sticking by Alex while we open up these Pokemon cards. There's a side duck, drowsy, rough wet. Reverse Hollow Kyurem. And another. Guys, so back to back, non holographic rares. Same exact card. One was the Talon Flame, and the other one was a Miltic. Miltic, I think it was. Miltic. Huh, interesting. So far, we've had, and the Evolving Skies, it is really, really hard. Their pull rates are low, but there is an opportunity to get some good stuff, man. These booster packs, this this uh, booster pack has a lot of good stuff. We are just having a difficult time of pulling it. All right. As I mentioned before, we have to get creative on how we can get content uh, for everyone, especially with the Evolving Skies, with the new... Uh, generation pokemon coming out in about 10 days or so it's actually becoming harder and harder to get booster packs like this like the darkness of blaze this one is still sealed for you guys uh, 
and then Lost Origin. Uh, these retail go for about 125 Right now, the Darkness of Blaze is about 160 The um, the Lost, um, what is it? The 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 Lost Origins is going for about 140 150 So as these new generation of Pokemon start coming, these booster boxes are becoming harder and harder and harder to find. And when we do find them, the price is just hiking up. But I'm here for the long haul, guys. I will provide as much content. This investment is for you guys. And again, thank you so much for subscribing, commenting, and uh, liking this channel. Uh, so this is a reverse. Uh, no, this is actually a, a full art Dur Duraludon V. So that looks like a really nice card. I don't have this card. It's a first for me. I will take it considering how many doubles I have, especially with the uh, Pokemon Go uh, series and the, uh, the Pokemon Go and the Celebrations um, series as well. A lot of doubles. So this is the last pack, guys. Um, I thought we would get something crazy, crazy, crazy exciting. Unfortunately, we did not. Uh, so far, but fingers crossed. Last pack, let Leo. Okay, Carvana, they're going under. Uh, this is a Seismitoad Reverse Hollow and a Glaceon V Max. Oh wow, that's a beautiful card, guys. Look at the color on that. First for me. Look at that. That looks absolutely awesome. That looks awesome, awesome, awesome. All right. So, not what we were expecting, not what we wanted, but I will, I'll take it. All right, guys. So, as promised, I have three more tints to go. Still some more content. Let's start off with the Articuno. What do you say? Again, these tins just dropped last week. I've seen some people open them. Pokey Rev. Shout out to Pokey Rev again. I don't know how he does it, man. He has so many subscribers, so many followers. Uh, I love his content. Love the layout of, of his uh, videos. He gets a whole bunch of stuff before people even get their hands on him. Every time he's making a video, I'm like two steps behind them. But shout out to Pokerev. Uh, love your content, bro. There's the Articuno. Beautiful artwork there. And we have Crown Zenith packs. So we got five Crown Zenith booster packs. Let's go ahead and put that to the side. I'm going to put this Articuno back. All right. Let's open up this one as well, just so we can get them all in line. And <laughs> this is good. this is nice artwork. Uh, I think that's a do duo or a do trio uh, running away from that Zapdos. They actually made the Zapdos into a fighting um, Pokemon. So there's five more there, guys. Uh, interestingly enough, because that's a legendary bird, electric. I'm more of the old school, still getting acclimated. I saw a uh, an Arcanine as a fighting Pokemon. I saw uh, just a whole bunch of fighting Pokemon that should be elementals. But hey, love the artwork. I'm not going against the grain here. Just uh, you can't beat the original. Here's the Moltres. Kind of reminds me of something weird from Stranger Things. Every time I see this, it reminds me of a figure from Stranger Things. Shout out to Netflix and Stranger Things if you guys have seen them. I've seen all of them. Um, great, great series. Uh, let's put that to the side. So, three tins, guys. Legendary Birds. We got five packs each, 15 in total. Let's get started and see what we can pull from these. Um, not familiar what's inside these packs. Um, but... We will find out together what we're going to get. All right. So let's do one, two, three, four, guys. And we have a Bidoof. Mr. Mime. They say Mr. Mime is bad luck. <gasps> guys, there's a Radiant Charizard. Man, that, that's a right off rip. That's a Radiant Charizard. Oh, man, that is beautiful. Let me see. I know the glare from the light, guys, may interfere, but that is worthy of us putting this in here. I think I have the, the, the layout wrong because that should have been the last card, and it wasn't. I'm going to figure out how this actually works. 
But on the first pack, guys, we got a Radiant Charizard. Man, oh man. If this is a sign of things to come, I am excited. All right, let me let me leave that standing up right there next to that Charizard. All right. I'm going to open up this pack regularly. I'm just going to go through the card just to see how many I have to go back. Um, all right, let's see here. So... I don't know what it is. Let's let's just go through it. All right. So we got a Tangela, Baltoy, a Meowth, Wallamar, Shinx. All right. So this was, I'll count it from the back. Let me see what we have here. All right. So it's one, two, three, four. Okay. All right. So this is a Trux, a Truxit. Tr let's try this again. Toxtricity, okay, toxic, I guess, Pokemon, it's an electric one, and guys, I know you saw it just a few seconds ago, but we have a Charizard V-Star, two back-to-back -back booster packs, two Charizards, here you are, talk about content, guys, talk about luck, because I have not had much luck lately, and man, oh man, uh, the Pokey Gods are on our side today because we just got two back to back, none of which I have. That looks absolutely beautiful. I'm going to keep these here to the side. Oh my God. Guys, second pack, Crown Zenith. Never opened this pack, but man, oh man, is it packing some stuff. Wow. We didn't have much luck with the first two tins, but man, this is looking like a pretty good pack to buy. All right, so we did one, two, three, four. We're gonna put that in the front here. Fire energy, all right. Another trainer, ultra ball there. Purloin, love disc. There you go, there's a Yamna, okay. Oh my God, there's a Leafeon V-Star. And a holographic Zamazenta. Guys, look at this. I don't know if this is normal. I don't know if it's like, uh, but I'm putting this away because just, just this looks freaking beautiful. Look at this, man. That's another V star. So two V stars, guys. A radiant Charizard. Oh my god. Oh my god. What is happening today? <laughs> What is happening today, guys? All right. One, two, three, four. Let's continue. All right, let's do it. Here's an energy. Oh, I don't actually have this Pokemon. That's interesting. Sal Azel. Carvanine. Girafferig. Wooloo. Shinx. Pancham. Snorunt. Poenard. Reverse Hollow Luxo and a uh, Blossom, non holographic. Okay, moving right along, guys. Did we get spoiled? Did we get spoiled with these tins? Man. Instead of the uh, energy, we got a V-Star there. All right. Here's a trainer. Matang. Haven't seen Metagross in a long time. Oddish. Seal. Potion. Aaron. Reverse. Hollow. Zacian. And a non-holographic rare. Pangoro. Okay. Move right along, guys. I don't know what cards we're looking for in this pack. I just know that we got three beautiful cards. And it's extremely rare to pull cards like that back to back to back. So if we don't pull anything else in this video, I mean, that's, that's Matang, huh? Um, it's going to be a disappointment, but in the overall scheme of things, it won't be because who pulls two Charizards um, on the same day? Oh, that's a pretty Pikachu, guys. Look at that. I don't have that one. I'm going to put that one away. And a non holographic rare in the back. I'm putting this one away. This one's cute. I don't have that one. All right. 
right. Still a couple of crowns in this to go, guys. I'm not discouraged. A few cards in here that I do not have, so I will take it. It beats the duplicates, right? I mean, man, when you're looking for a rare card and you just get duplicates all the time, Tangela, it can become a little frustrating. Reverse Hollow Emolga. <laughs> they uh, a holographic energy. I'll put this one away simply because I have the, I now have the water energy and now I have the grass energy. So I'll go ahead and um, and put this away as well. All right, guys, moving right along, moving right along. Okay, Crown Zenith, Crown Zenith, guys. One, two, three, four. Instead of an energy, we have another V star, guys. Let's uh, see what we can get here. All right. This is cute. Love disc. Molga. Yamna, again. What is that? This is a Corliss's experiment, full art, and a non holographic rare. Look at that. Don't have this one yet. And we will put this away. I'll take it. That's pretty sweet. I'll take it. We're getting some hits, guys. We're getting some hits. I don't know what the pull rate percentage is on this pack. Again, it's the first time for me. Uh, just wanted to get some new content for you guys. I don't want to keep repeating the same booster packs to try to get. That's just me being selfish, trying to get them all. But isn't that the point? Catch them all. It's just becoming a little more difficult, as I mentioned before. Uh, Gudra. And Mewtwo. Look at that. Guys, look at that Mewtwo. Holographic. All right. And then look at the Gudra. Full art. Not V or anything. Not sure how the Crown Zenus works, but I'm putting that away ASAP. And I'm putting this Mewtwo away because that's neat. That is neat. Clean two. Might be a solid nine if we rate it. Huh. All right. Let's see what else we got here, guys. Okay. One, two, three, four. Energy. Less so. Great ball. Meowth. Tangela. Rockwell. Reverse hollow. Wallamer. And the non holographic Yan Mega. All right. Non holographic Yan Mega. All right. A couple packs left, guys. We're down to our last five. All right. One, two, three, four. Let's see what we got here. Energy. Ultra Ball, Bidoof, Yamna. I'm seeing a lot of Yamnas left disc. Reverse, Hollow, Tangrowth. Is that the evolution of Tangela? Yes, it is. And a non holographic Scizor. All right. Toy and the Snorlax uh, non holographic. All right, guys, we're down to our last three. Let's see what we got here. Reverse hollow, sweet, and a non holographic executor. All right, man, did we get some bangers earlier on? Could you imagine if we finished the video off like that? Finishing the video off with those bangers? Oh man, that would have been crazy. All right, let's do it. One, two, three, four. Energy. Can we finish it off with another banger, guys? Can we do it? Mr. Mime. Oh, what is this? Thievil. 
and an Agron. So we have a Thievel. Full art there. That's pretty sweet. All right, I'm going to put this one away. I don't have this one. So let's go ahead and put that away real quick. We want to protect the integrity of the cards. And there is a regular holographic Agron. I had a ton, a ton of reverse hollow errands. I'll go ahead and put this one away. Awesome. Last but not least, the last crown Zenith. Dum, dum, dum. Let's see what we got here. All right. One, two, three. All right. We have a V-Star instead of an Energy. Oddish, Corfish, Pokeball. A Reverse, Hollow, Helio, Helioptile, and a Non-Holographic Lycanroc. All right. Well, that's it for the packs, guys. Uh, again, thank you so much for joining me. Let me just go over what we were able to get today we got a holographic agron we got a thievel holographic mewtwo sweet guys gudra full art uh uh what is this colrus's experiment trainer card full art holographic energy Full Art Pikachu. Looks sweet. We have a Charizard VMAX. We have a Leafeon VMAX. Excuse me. V-Star. I apologize. V-Star. And then we have a Radiant Charizard, guys. From the Crown Zenith pack. So, that is what we got today. I'm actually going to open up these cards here so you guys can get a better look at the legendary birds it's only right so there is the legendary bird moltres full art looks sweet i'm gonna go ahead and put that away we have the legendary bird zapdos Chasing away the Dodrio. And we're going to also put this one away. And last but not least, Moltres, our last legendary bird. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, Articuno. I apologize. That's just beauty. That's beauty in and of itself. The artwork on these cards is actually, it's just beautiful. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for joining. Always appreciate the time you can share with me. Uh, still striving to collect them all. Um, next uh, video will be the Brilliant Stars. I'm going to open up all three uh, Elite Trainer boxes. We have to get creative with how we can provide content to you guys. There's no more booster boxes on the market. Again, like, subscribe, uh, 85A Correa. Uh, all the love and support is appreciated. Until next time, take care.